Guys, I just ordered um, chicken in because I wasn't in the mood of cooking. Also, my voice, I don't know what happened to my voice. This is how the chicken looks like. Although it's a bit cold, I don't know why. Um, let me try and warm it up. And yeah, that's my dinner for today. The next day. So on this particular day I was going out on a date and I was really really late uh, so I was not able to film anything not even my outfit and I was looking really cute the only thing that I managed to film was uh, the drink or the cocktail that I took and that's what I'm going to show you but yeah next time I guess I'm just going to be on time so that I can even get ready with you guys but just enjoy uh, the small montage of the view wow this day was so beautiful the sun was just shining bright it was such such a good day Welcome back to a new vlog. How's everybody doing? So today I'm all dressed up because I want to go and run some errands. Yes, what else is new? Uh, I don't know if I'm going to show you my outfit because I feel like you've seen it so many times by now. I have a plaid blazer, white bodysuit, black. Um, I don't know if you can see black. Um, what? Black tights and some sneakers. Uh, so yeah, I feel like this is like the perfect fit for errands. It's cute but not too much. And then the weather is like misbehaving so i don't know if it will rain later so that's why i need my jacket jacket that's why i need my blazer just to be on the safe side uh so after my errands i want to pass by um house of leather i haven't been there in such a long time and i want to buy some decor pieces especially my coffee table it's literally very empty and my tv stand as well so that's the agenda for today if anything else comes up I'm going to show you obviously if not we'll just continue with the vlog the next day so for my bag today i want to switch up my bag i'm always carrying that black bag and honestly it's too much it's too much so i'm carrying this bag that i got from my thrift page so as i was saying uh today i want to switch up my bag into this um really cute bag that i got from my thrift page i want to give that black bag a break honestly i feel like i have carried it too much so for those who are new here i have a thrift page that is called stacy thrifted bags um as a matter of fact before we even leave i want to show you a few pieces that i've recently gotten like i've restocked for my business i know you guys you don't like uh seeing this but so i'm going to only show you my favorite bags so that at least you can have an idea of uh, what we are selling over my page so yeah kindly follow it and i'd really appreciate if you get something if you see something just dm me just comment on this video and i'll get back to you so let me set you up um i show you a few bags then we head out i think this is a decent angle so let me actually show you now the bags that i'll be carrying I think you guys have seen this bag. I've shown it to you before. I absolutely love this bag. Like, it's so cute. So here are the few bags that are my absolute favorite. So the first bag is this. Um, it's actually a designer. I really don't know how to pronounce this name, so I'm not going to embarrass myself. But this is the first bag that I thrifted. Absolutely gorgeous. It also has a sling like that amazing i love it by the way and it's very affordable all these bags that i'm going to show you are under 
a thousand bob so here is the next bag that i treated it's like a shoulder bag let me bring it closer so that you can see the details all the bags are in perfect condition i believe i've i've shown you this bag before it looks like this very cute as well i love munya tamuke bag and it's in perfect condition because this one looks like a brand new bag gorgeous right um another bag that is my favorite is this guys i'm into slim bags i think you already can tell by now is this white slim bag let me bring it closer so that you can see let's get into the details absolutely gorgeous such a nice cute uh slim bag we also have uh this i know there are people who are like into this type of bag especially those people who are like into raves raving you can put your things here because it's like um a front bag like this so let me see if i can bring it down here so that you can see like in a bed boy so when you're going to a place where your things might be unsafe you know your things are intact well another favorite bag of mine is this white bag that looks like this let's get into it this was one of my favorites this and the first one this bag and this absolutely gorgeous i love them this is also another bag that i got gorgeous 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 oh another bag that i got is this slim bag this is actually from zara let me bring it closer so that you can see the the beads i love it by the way that's how the inside looks like when you sound okay back at a family sana get into it let's get into it this is such a gorgeous bag although it has already been bought but this was so cute honestly yeah let's get into the design absolutely gorgeous and it's in perfect perfect condition oh i feel like this would also have like gone well with my outfit right such a gorgeous bag yeah i was actually checking myself in the mirror this is actually such a nice bag you can carry it like that mm -hmm. let me see well this one looks like that let me get closer gorgeous right such a gorgeous gorgeous bag i think i've already shown you this before but imagine i bought this and then after kufika kwa nyumba nikapata iko na dent so guys i'm really trying to like do this haul <laughs> very quickly i also have this gucci dupe fur bag it looks like this and it's a bit dirty so yeah guys <clears throat> that's uh some of the bags that i was able to thrift as i've said you can go and check my thrift page it's called stacy thrifted bags that's where i post everything you can turn on your, not your notification yes i think you can do that so that every time i post something you are notified so yeah let's let's head out let's go run some errands and then yeah we'll see how everything goes been a few hours but it felt like days Only been days but it felt like months I've been gone for a year, only go like once Life moves fast and you do what you want I guess I'm doing what I want Hope you know what you want Look like Tyler Perry But she don't love me She too scary My old bitch was like Jackie Brown I don't wanna know But she too down Will you be my leading lady? I want a contract Get no baby guys so today i want to attempt to make mandazis it will literally be the first time so i'm just from the shop and i got a uh, prestige margarine so i saw this uh, recipe on tiktok and she was saying that you must use this so i went out and got that i also got uh, some baking powder because the flour that i have is not self-rising 
and then some milk and then i'll add cinnamon sugar and yeah that's it i have never cooked mandazis in my life but you know what these are some of the things that i really want to learn to make including chapatis and all that but yeah today let's attempt making this and see how it turns out wish me luck guys this bitch Guys, that's how my mandazis turned out. You know what? For the first time, I'm really... For like someone who was making this for the first time, I'm really um, impressed with how this came out. So two things Zenyani may notice I did wrong was to let the oil uh, get too hot in your manner. That's why zinakani kama almost zinaungwa. That was one of the problem. And then another thing that I did was when I was rolling the dough, uh i let it like siku roll ikae thin it was a bit thick so the mandazi is gonna a lot of uh dough on the inside but zimeva i absolutely love this you know what i i hope next time when i do this it, it will look uh better but i'm impressed now it's time to impress my neighbors with what i have come up with <laughs> so yeah they look really good honestly i'm impressed for real <laughs>
fast and you do what you want. I guess I'm doing what I want. Hope you know what you want. Look like Tyler Perry But she don't love me She's too scary My hope is fun like Jackie Brown I don't wanna know but she too down Will you be my leading lady? I wanna contract death, no baby In the meantime Guys, I honestly need to get myself a blender. I'm trying to uh, crush these tomatoes. Uh, I know there's that party that uh, is usually used to like kata kata before it go kabisa. I think I've seen it somewhere. I think that is also what I should get either that or a blender. Because I don't even have any other use for a blender. But even in Yazina Nipo, by the way, like they were not right, so has really fun. Guys, in Nigeria, we have to get the kafuku. Kafuku is a must. It's my dinner. Um, today I was lucky. One, I was lucky contemplating on making chapatis by myself. But on second thought, I was like, eh, hey, what's that? Tony and Daisy is a local, <laughs> so that's what I'm having. And then, uh, East you see me on any kitchen and and then some avocado on the side because one thing about me, I will eat everything with avocado. But yeah, that's my final product. I think it looks pretty decent, yeah. Welcome back to another video. I am super stressed out. Okay, it's been a long, long time. We're gonna get into it, but right now I am on a Guys, we've come to the end of the vlog. I know this vlog was a bit like uh, everywhere. Either that or it didn't have like a lot of things that I was doing, but this is the reality of my life. Sometimes I have like a lot of things to show, sometimes I don't. And I feel like this vlog was just one of those vlogs where I didn't have a lot of things to do. I know initially I had said that I wanted to visit House of Lesser, but I didn't manage to do that. I guess I'll just do that in my next vlog. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you on my next one. How you gonna sit in and like it was nothing? Yeah. How you gonna grow it over? How you gonna make it so damn hard to explain?